things. And as I was driving up, I was just thinking about when I was great. And, you know, you think a lot. You dream a lot. And it's always something that you don't know what you're going to do as you progress in life. But making the right choices is one of the biggest things that's going to mold you into doing the right thing in the future. Um, I remember when I was your age, I, I, I didn't know what I was going to do. And some of you may be like that. You just didn't know what was going on. Maybe things are not as good at home as they should be. It's some of the, the greatest place for me to come when I was growing up was the school. Because I knew when I came to school that I got to see my friends and my teachers. And, and I knew that they loved me. And you know, so many, so many people today, they don't get enough love. They get a lot of discipline, but they don't get enough love. And that's, you know, what, what you dream of right now is what you need to set your sights on later on. I remember when I was your age, I was a little bitty old, just a little bitty old thing. That's how I started growing up. I, I knew I wanted to do medicine. I just knew that that's something that I wanted to do. And I knew I wanted to teach school and come. So even if it's your age, you can be thinking about what you might want to do. So there's going to be a lot of people that's going to tell you you can't do it. Not, I promise you that. And there's going to be fewer people that tell you that you can't. And that's why having a belief in yourself is so important. Believe in yourself when nobody else does. And one of the things that I learned when I was in, in your age is don't get free. When you make life hard on yourself, it becomes easy. It becomes easy. If there's something that you want to do, who never wants to work in their life? Who never wants to work? Man, I can tell you how you never have to go to work. Thank you. 
and don't ever stop. There's one thing that you should never get enough of. You can't get enough of it. And then it can never hurt you. And that's education. You, you can't get enough education, and it will never hurt you. It will only help you. So, you know, that's my, that's my story to you guys. And sometimes, you know, you're going to be on top. You may be on, some of you may be on top of the world today. Some of you may be on the bottom. But I can tell you this. Every one of y'all, including me, will be, it'll be the other way around at some point in our life. That's the way life is. Sometimes you're going to be on the top. Sometimes you're going to be on the bottom. But the one thing's for certain, you're never going to stay there. If you get knocked down, you get back up. Make it a goal that there's a, if there's a course, if there's something that you're studying in school, and you're not doing that good at it, go ask your teacher for some help. Ask your teacher for some help. Say, look, you know, this math problem is just hard for me. And I need you to help explain that to me. And they'll explain it to you and they'll work with you, but they can't help you unless you talk to them. Okay? So school is a lot of things for a lot of people. I know it was for me. And but if there's things that you need to talk about that's going on in your life that's bothering you, tell your teachers about it. Tell your counselor about it. Talk to them about that. But everybody has to have a goal. Y'all leave out here today. Everybody, think about what your goals are. You see the basketball game? Everybody see the basketball game? Everybody see one of those. Everybody see the football game. In a football game, what do you have? You have a field goal. In a basketball game, you have a goal. You shoot the ball in. What if you took the goal away? How would you eat school? You have nothing to eat school on. So if you have no goal, then you, you have no school. You don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're trying to go up against. So have a goal, have a vision, have a call, and then pursue it. Nothing comes easy in life but that's worth something. Because you know, if it was, if it was easy, then everybody would do it. Everybody would do it. But sometimes you may have to stay up. You may have to stay up a little later. You may have to study a little bit longer. But you're learning and you're progressing and you're building toward your future. You're building toward your future. But now's the time to have a dream. Now's the time, now's the time to have a dream. Because, you know, I've been, I meet people that are in junior college. And I ask them, like, what are you studying? What, what do you want? What do you want to do? And they go, I don't know. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. You know, you need to decide early. Decide early. Make up your mind what you want to do, and then go pursue that. Okay. Um, you know, you may be small now. You may be small now. You may get your Brooks work when you're out of high school and you're and you're 18 years old. But never give up on what you really like to do. Never give up. Uh, y'all heard of Beethoven? Y'all heard of Beethoven? Did you show me your classes? Yeah. You know one thing, did anybody know what was special about Beethoven? The one thing that was that was so special about him that is amazing. He was one of the greatest artists of, the, of our time. Does anybody know what, he, what, what, he, what, what happened to him? Exactly. He, he was actually dead. They hope he was dead, but yet he was one of the best musicians the world has ever known. There's a woman. Does anybody know a woman that was extremely famous? She was the first. 